Hi, welcome to my channel. So today in this video, I will show you that how to modify this HP 1400 watts of power supply. It's model AHSTN PD43. It's 1400 watts. It can give 12 volt at maximum 117 amps. So we are going to mod this. It's uh, doing. Uh, it gives uh, standard 12 volts output, but I want to mod it to 13 to 14 volts. We also ha have to hack its over voltage protection, which triggers at high voltage to shut down the power supply. So first, turn on the power supply. You can see that the green indicator light is on. It's a quite compact, high power and low noise power supply. One more thing is that here you can see these to turn on the power supply after uh, plugging the power cord from left to right these there are meant couple of pins so you have to short the first three pins from left to right to turn on the power supply so whenever you plug it in directly to 220 volts input so the power supply will automatically turn on so you don't have to install any uh, further switch on front side so that's it let me show you that it's giving 12 volts output you can see that it's giving 12.6 volts so let's open it up first carefully unplug from the main power source so there are only two screws to open the power supply take the flat and forward screwdriver from the screws simply slide and So let's dive into the this portion to hold the this cover simply put the tape After this, you can do your work very comfortably. Remove this cover with the help of the screwdriver. So what you are going to do, let's, it's the closer look. So I'm not going deep into this. It's explanation that how this section of the circuit, this works. Actually, what you have to do is to add some resistor to increase the voltage and further a second resistor you also have to install to hack its over voltage protection so means if you are it's giving 12.5 volts default output uh, of factory setting uh, at factory settings so when you increase it to 13.5 volts or 14 volts the power supply is already set to trigger at 13.5 volts or 14 it the over voltage protection will pop and the power supply will shut down so we have to bypass it so what you have to do simply take the 22k resistor and solder between these two points this uh, 
these are the couple of empty points so this first one this is the ground and you have to solder between the upper leg of this potentiometer here and the second point you will have to solder it to the ground here so i am using the 22k resistor here to increase the voltage up to 13.8 volts so simply install the resistor between these two points i am going to solder it to this smd capacitor because it's a lot easier to solder here instead of the upper leg of this potentiometer so let's do it so as you can see here that i have soldered the 22k resistor from this pin this first pin this was the ground to the upper point of this smd resistor which is also connected to this upper leg of this potentiometer i also added this teflon covering in to insulate the leg to avoid touching it to the other points so be careful in connecting the resistor points because if you uh, solder to the wrong points maybe your power supply can be permanently damaged or dead they are very 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 difficult to repair so the second point this was the first step is now completed now we have to head towards the hacking the over voltage protection so as you can see that on the bottom of this second pin from left one two trace this smd resistor here and uh, solder the 5.6k resistor between the bottom leg of this smd resistor from here to the this fourth pin which is also ground this smd resistor here and this point so the over voltage protection will go up to more than 14 volts or something so it will not pop up the protection when we are using the power supply so let's also do the second step so finally i have connected these two resistors also the second one here which i told you that the solder to the bottom pin of this smd resistor here and between this ground point here so let's cover the this area So now let's power it up to check that it's working or not. Carefully don't touch the circuit while the power supply is on. So let's plug in the power cord. Carefully don't touch the circuit while the power supply is running. you can see that the green indicator light is on the power supply is now turned on so carefully handle it now let me check the voltage yep as you can see that the voltage is now 13.76 13.96 volts you can see that the previous was 12.6 volts so for uh, to fix this at 13.8 volts you need uh, i think 6.8k resistor for that i use 5.6k so it's good for me i can use my some applications and uh, to charge my batteries i can use this voltage so 
that was the tutorial so hope you enjoyed if you have uh, it was so simple i just told you that points where you have to solder these two resistors first one to increase the voltage and the second one is to bypass the over voltage protection so if you have any questions you can ask me in the comment section don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel stay tuned for the next video